what uh, different steps brought you to today, to the NHL camp? Uh, I would say going to a lot of different clinics and uh, a lot of summer camps and just taking information from all the older guys and guys with more experience and watching what they do and how they go about refereeing. Did you envision to eventually go to the NHL? Is that something that you had a goal right from the get-go? Uh, yeah, well not off the beginning, but as I get into it and start doing better hockey and realize that it was can be a job that you could pursue, I kind of would like to push for it. What kind of skills do you, do you need to make it to the NHL? Uh, definitely to be a uh, top shape, that's the, probably the biggest thing, and uh, know a little bit about the game, obviously, and uh, just overall have a good sense for hockey. For you, what, what really gets you to come to the rink? Uh, it's a little bit of everything, like I love hockey, grew up playing hockey and wasn't very good, so I decided that refereeing to stay and kind of go up the ranks a bit would be better off on the referee side of things and just to be involved in the game. Is it difficult to have that lifestyle where every weekend you're working? Is it something that's difficult or is it, you know, you like it because you can have other occupations during the week? It's it's good because you can have the like an 8-4 to four job and then you can still go to the rink and do your refereeing in the night and have kind of best of both worlds.